the physicians I work with really consider ICAD as a second reader. So kind of more like the European model where you're not doing a consensus op opinion or review with somebody, but you, you definitely feel like there's somebody else reading with you. It, there's a, definitely an extra uh, comfort level with that. And then it, it just makes you faster as you learn to trust the computer. You know, you learn to understand the technology a little bit better. Um, so we have always done batched screening reading at our facility. So we've always had protected reading time for our physicians. Um, that has been mandate, you know, been a program that we've run for about seven to eight years. I actually we modeled it after the Scripps Institute out in California, um, a batch reading program that they um, instituted and published. Um, and it's been very successful. We've been very efficient doing that. We don't sort on the on the case score, which I know a lot of places potentially do. Um, but nevertheless, we've been able to slowly increase our assignment without totally killing the radiologists for uh, their reading of their cases on, on a daily workload basis. Um, it, it's been very positive. You know, that's been one of the few very positive things in during the pandemic for us has been having ICAT around, to be honest with you.